Um, tackling something. Ever since I was a small child, I have wanted to be a Jedi. <laughs> I don't know what Jedi is, but it's rarely put it in there. You don't know what a Jedi is. I told you I don't watch Star Wars. Just read, just read the script. Now I can use the Force to censor tech news. So here it is. We first heard about Fuchsia OS a few years ago when internal sources at Google mentioned it as a possible replacement for Android. Well, a new report from Bloomberg says Fuchsia OS is alive and well and being developed up as a single unifying operating system to run on not only phones, but also PCs and smart home devices within five years. Google has thrown a bit of cold water on the report. However, telling news outlet that Fuchsia is still very experimental and doesn't have a timetable for its release. But do we really need a replacement for Android? I don't. I have, I have an iPhone. I, I have Android phone. Yes, I do, Riley. I you had an iPhone. No, I have this phone for a long time. It looks like an iPhone. This is an iPhone. Sharing is caring, and that's why you care about me. And that's why Google, Microsoft, Twitter, and Facebook have teamed up to start the data transfer project. The project aims to make it super easy to transfer data between all the different cloud storage services. That's why it's called the data transfer project, because it transfers data. If the tech company if the tech company super team manages to get it right, you will be able to simply import or export photos or documents, songs, or anything else directly from services like Google Drive to anywhere else. But then if I want to move all my stuff from OneDrive to Google Drive, Microsoft is going to be helping me leave them. It's like helping your ex move into their new partner's house. And I can say from my experience, I don't have experience. <laughs> Western Digital has primarily been known for producing hard drives, but it looks like it's majorly shifting focus to solid state drives, SSD. I think everyone knows that. The storage company has shut down one of its major hard drives factories in Malaysia that has been operating for more than 20 years. They also announced the production of new 3D NAND storage in partnership with Toshiba that can fit 1.33 terabits of data onto 96 layer chips, not 69. It's QLC flash, which isn't as durable as SLC or MLC, but it could mean more high capacity, lower cost SDs, basic hard drive, there. The era. The era of spinning this is over. Yes. Accept your defeat. It's over. You're done. Yeah. Sorry. It's time for QuickBit, sponsored by Memory Express. If you are looking to buy electronics in Canada, let me tell you, these guys are good and cool and friendly. Memory Express has great customer care with 15-day return exchanges, so Canadians can feel good about their electronics and themselves. Plus, with their Uber price beat guarantee, they will be able to beat any authorized Canadian retailer's price by 10% of the difference, both in store and online. Yeah. Click the link below, right here. Yeah. Here. Whoa. Here. Whoa. Here. Whoa. All right, settle down. <laughs> so, that's back to some real news again. Samsung's folding phone is looking realer than ever with multiple news outlets reporting on separate sources that point to a 2019 release of a device with a flexible screen and a smaller display on the outside for notifications. Too bad, I won't be able to buy this because I have an iPhone. No, I, Riley, I have, oh my God, I have Are you sure, Dennis? Nvidia phone. It's a good time to be an eSports fan as multiple sports are in the lead up to championship right now, including Overwatch, League of Legends, and Call of Duty. Engage has a great guide for anyone interested at yelling at a computer screen about virtual games that don't matter instead of yelling at a TV about real life games that don't matter. I'm confused. <laughs> Facebook has decided to start enforcing their age limits, restricting children under 13 from using the service. They are also releasing a new messenger app in Mexico, specifically targeted at kids. Which is it? Which do you want? What do you want, Facebook? 
Make up your mind. Also, the kids are all on Instagram and Snapchat and everywhere. In the uh, parks, everywhere. So you are kind of too late. Yeah. Kony has released Gorilla Glass 6, which will allow device to survive up to 15 drops without damage. Lions need this. But only 15. It's impossible to protect against damage after 16 drops. It's a universal law of physics. Believe me, yeah. I'm good at physics. Unless you are Jedi. I don't know who Jedi is, but I think <laughs> just don't drop your things like Linus. And right now, if you search idiot in Google's images, you will get pictures of Donald Trump. I don't know why this is news though. Sounds like Google is working correctly. I didn't mean to say that. It's in the script. <laughs> when, when Riley. Yeah, when Riley. Said it. Yes. I, I didn't say that. Beep, 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 beep. beep. Say, man. And that's it for Telling, guys. Subscribe for more tech news three times a week. Like if you like the video, and please dis just don't dislike it because. Just don't dislike my videos, please. <laughs> I think I'm out, and but I'm doing a cool outro. Okay. Let's see. What are you gonna do, Dennis? This is cool on internet, apparently. Let's do. Are you a magician? <laughs> Did you see me? Yes. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs>